Welcome in, meteorologist Steve Madero here on this wet and messy Monday. We've got to deal with a whole lot of rain and wind for the next couple of hours. We're still watching the snow as it's creeping in from the north. The rain snow line creeping down to the south, getting closer and closer. Areas of Williamsburg and parts of the Middle Peninsula, we're getting some reports of some sleet mixing in with the rain. Elsewhere around Hampton Roads, it has just been the rain, but this system has had everything and still does. With the rain and wind across Hampton Roads, the snow to the north, pounding snow for the nation's capital. And then you've got this strong line of thunderstorms. Racing on by the outer banks. Fortunately, it is moving offshore. The warnings associated with have expired, but a couple flashes of lightning with this. While there's snow into portions of um, uh, the uh, uh, portions of the northern part of the the Commonwealth and the state uh, across uh, the the. Outer Banks, it's a mess across Tower Camp 10, wet and windy, and we're seeing uh, big reports of flooding going on because of the high tide. We have pretty much hit the high tide now about a half hour or so ago. So moving forward into the afternoon, we will see the water slowly start to recede, but ever, ever, ever so slowly as we get back down to some lower tide uh, this afternoon. So we're going to be dealing with flooding of low-lying areas because of all the rain and the wind. Look at this. It's over uh, 40 miles an hour gusting, and it will do so for the remainder of our afternoon. Now, where's the snow? Because that's everything everyone wants to know. Where's the snow? By late morning and the next half hour to about midday, we're going to start to see that rain snow line creep a little bit further to the south. The rain will flip over to snow briefly for lunchtime before it moves on out by this evening. The evening commute just going to be wet and slick as things start to improve and remain on the breezy, just cold side. Temperatures are going to be crashing tonight. We'll likely wake up tomorrow morning and it'll feel like the teens and low 20s. So the mess will continue for the rest of our uh, late morning into early afternoon before things drastically improve. Just keep an eye out for water on the roadways. We're getting plenty of reports uh, for, uh, over the past really half hour or so. We'll have more updates for you in the next half hour. We'll get back on here with Jeremy. We'll check in with Asia Telefer. She's out in Norfolk. And then we'll have all your updates, of course, over on wavy.com. We'll get you back to your regularly televised programs.